welcome back today i'm going to perform a small video on the oral filtering uh, this is the end user uh, uh, test user so from this uh, i should be able to reach your internet connectivity should i should have internet so let's try to ping the google dns and let check the some social networking signs Yes, I have the internet connectivity. So here is the game plan. So first, what we'll do? So we will try to access all the Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, all the social networking sites later. First, we'll log the all the social networking sites, and later we will allow one social networking sites. So whether our URL filtering is working or not. So first, try to check with the Facebook. Facebook. And let's try Insta. And so we will create our uh, role first. So right now I have already logged into the Cisco FMC pages, Facebook, Insta. Now we will block the all social networking uh, sites. Then we will test it. And later what we will do, we will specifically allow Insta. So later we will check it. So ah, later. So Facebook and LinkedIn should not uh, like you know uh, get the login page and Insta should have a, a login page. So let's wait for some time. So, yeah, I think uh, we got the uh, FMC page here. Okay, go to the FTD. Uh, I did this. Uh, click on edit button. So we got all the interfaces inside outside. So go to the policy and access control. You can go to the ACL, click on edit. Okay, we have one rule here uh, stating like you know source from inside and destination to outside and so uh, network is LAN uh, network destination is any and action is allowed so from this rule we can able to access all the uh, social networking sites so what we will do is first we will block this one create a rule add rule okay mention the name as Block social network sites. Okay, action should be block one. Source is from inside and destination is outside. And come to the network. Source is our LAN network. And uh, go to the go to the URL in that social here is the social networking sign add to the add to rule and come to the login and check this box log at beginning of connection click on click on add button so we got the rule uh, right below the inside to outside. So we should, uh, whenever we are blocking it, so first rule state that allow all the whatever the comes, whatever source is inside and destination is outside. So if we put the, uh, our block rule in next uh, second line, so it will not block because the first rule says allow. So we need to put it in first save the changes okay go to deploy click on deployment Okay, select the FTD one, 
device and click on deploy and click on deploy so it will take some time to deploy the changes so meanwhile i will pause this video okay policy pushed completely so i have checked the facebook i have opened in incognito mode so when i try to access the facebook uh, url at uh, waiting site cannot be reached and similarly i am trying for the instagram so let uh, wait for some more time because it's taking uh, time so meanwhile what we'll do we will go to the analysis check the events whether uh, what we are getting is there any block or it's allowed so let's see so i think still i'm not able to see any response from the insta okay uh, i'm not able to access insta and facebook let's log in again yeah so if we go to the events we get getting a block here uh, for facebook if you go to the end so it will be insta facebook insta facebook so we have blocked the social networking sites so let's like you know now what we'll do we will allow one exception rule exception rule in the sense we will allow one uh, url uh, in this case i'm using the insta instagram so i will allow the instagram to access it and go to the policy go to the policy access control access control Okay, so we got the policy so go to the uh, click on edit button okay, click on add rule new rule in that you can mention uh, a lot Instagram. Set. Okay. Action is allowed. Zone is inside. Outside uh, inside. Source zone is inside. Destination zone is outside. And network is LAN network. Inside LAN network. And go to the URL. And uh, here is the URL category and uh, create an object, new object for uh, Insta. So you can create a www dot. You can write it Instagram. Okay. And save, save it. Okay, so logging here is log at the beginning connection and log at the end connection. Click on add. Okay, so we need to take this at the top. Okay, allow Instagram send. Source is inside, destination is outside, source zone is LAN, source network is LAN and okay I think here URL we have not added we have created the object so we have not added that URL here Insta add to rule okay click save okay so URL is Instagram dot uh, com so save the changes Click on deploy. Ok, 
can select the FTD device and click on deploy. So it will take some time, meanwhile I will pause this video. Okay, our uh, deployment got successful. So now we will go to the test PC and we will try to access the Facebook and uh, Insta. Okay, Next, yeah. I think I can able to view the Insta username and password. It's uh, asking for the username and password, but still Facebook is uh, not able to get the any page. So let's go to the events. So we'll verify the connections events. Okay, I can see uh, blog for 157 that is uh, Facebook and 142 is for install. Let's see. Okay, content of Facebook, Facebook, Facebook. Okay, you can see the Insta here. Insta is allowed. So we have uh, just to summarize, we have performed the first. We have blocked all the social networking sites, including so. Uh, 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 Facebook and Insta and later uh, we have created an exceptional rule allow rule to access the uh, Insta social networking site so with this event we can uh, can conclude that we have complete our URL filtering lab so I hope this video has been informative for you and I would like to say thank you for watching